Hi and welcome back to Seasims 4 and today I will be doing a Parenthood Kitchen room build and it's on the gallery now as you're listening to this as a kitchen room under the title Parenthood Kitchen <laughs> um, and my gallery is CCS Sims 4 so you should be able to get it there if you want to put it into your houses and I think it turned out nicely. I've used kind of the blue blue theme this time. Um, well, I use blue theme most of the time, so that's nothing new really. But anyway, I think this will probably be my last parenthood build. Well, build centered around the parenthood pack. Because I've already done a house, an apartment, and now a room build. So three is enough, probably. But I did read today that... Um, it's probable that pets will be out in November and oh, I cannot wait for pets. I can already see my pets build now. It's going to be a big farm, white 360 veranda house with a kennel in the back and a little paddock with some horses. If they do bring horses, they better bring horses back, I swear to God. I've heard rumours that it's only going to be cats and dogs and that would make me very, 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 very upset. I need horses in the game because it just it adds to that whole country horse farm feel and I need it I need it so this kitchen is a little bit more traditional than modern I'd say it is a bit all over the place in terms of what era it's from it's got those traditional cabinets but then I've included those um, columns there with that sort of stone um, which sort of comes from the mid-century modern era sort of thing I guess so it is a bit confusing I'm not really sure why I put those columns in there looking back I think it was because I just I couldn't find a column of the right size that I wanted so I just put those in and I carry in that stone around to um, a thicker column in the dining breakfast bar area later on so that it flows a little bit more and the columns don't seem totally out of place also, the other day while I was trying to upload my um, parenthood apartment, I realised that you can't actually upload an entire apartment. And it made me so mad. You have to do it room by room. And I didn't even know that. So, in regards to my last build that I uploaded my apartment, you will have to download the two bedrooms separately, the bathroom and then the kitchen living all separately as separate rooms. So, there's four separate rooms, which is really really irritating honestly I don't know who thought of that I don't know why you can't put apartments in the gallery it, uh, this game has so many frustrating elements that I just wish I could fix anyway I'll just stop talking about that now because if I keep going I will be here for hours complaining about every single thing wrong with this game so we're on to the breakfast nook now with a little table some chairs now this isn't meant to be like the main dining room in a family home or anything, it's just a little add-on to the kitchen. Um, what I'd probably do if I was putting this in a house, I'd attach it. See that door there on the diagonal angle, the one with the glass? I'd put that into a nice big living room and then have a dining room off that living room. So it flows quite nicely. Then a hallway, bedrooms, bathrooms, whatever. That's how I sort of see this room coming into play in a, in a big house. So we're nearly at the screenshots now. That was pretty quick. Um, and yeah, thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. I do put out videos. Well, I don't really have a schedule, but it's just whenever I have free time, basically, or whenever I'm bored. Um, but I do enjoy it a lot. I, I really, really do. And thank you if you have subscribed and you do watch my videos. All right, so I'll see you again next time.